Well, there, there's always stuff, you know, you're going to learn from, from being out there and playing them. Um, we did some really, really good things and played really well for lots of stretches of that game. Didn't, didn't quite get the ball to bounce our way, really. Um, uh, we played a lot of zone in that game as well. But, that, you know, again, there's more of a stretch of, you said, a lot of games. I think there was a lot of guys out as well at that time. So we were, I don't know, pretty happy, really, with the effort and putting ourselves in position to win. But we just didn't get it done. Mm -hmm. How much you depend on what you've seen and, uh, as opposed to what you know? Well, you certainly, you know, got to dig up your coverages and all that stuff from the past, right? And, you, you know, you stick with those and, and go with them from there. I'm, I'm, I know he's working his way back in, and, and um, uh, it's great to see him back, though, first of all. I think he's a great person and a really, really great player in this league, and it's great to see him back. But we got to do our work to, you know, to, to get ourselves ready for him, that's for sure. Yeah, it's you know anytime on those Eric when those things happen, you're you you are. Um, well, it's 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 never fun to be there when those things happen and you see them go down and you're just hoping they aren't serious. And then of course this one turned out to be very very serious uh, with him. Um, that like I said, I'm you know it's 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 uh, great to see him back and let's hope he's back to you know full full health and full rhythm and timing and all that stuff quickly. When do, you, when do you guard him like he, you know, is a you know, all NBA player? And when do you guard him like a guy who's played three games in a year? Well, I think you gotta guard him, um, you know, like an all NBA player. You know, you really, you really do. It's not like you're. Uh, I, I can't look at him out there and think he's not that guy. You know what I mean? And I, and our guys can't do it either. And. I don't think that's really on anybody's mind. We go out there and we play him. We're gonna, you know, we'll show him the things he's historically done, et cetera, in the film, and uh, you know his go-to moves and all that kind of stuff, and get ready for those. A year ago at this time, Mark came in and really gave you guys a boost going into the stretch run. Do you think you need something like that this year? Do you look at it and say, well, those guys that are coming back, hopefully in the next few weeks, are, are your mid-season acquisition? Um, I don't know. I think that um, I think I'm I'm confident. First of all, wh whichever whichever way things end up going, right? Uh, I really believe in this group. I think there's um, guys that have certainly raised their own profile, which has in turn raised the profile of our team. Um, I think we've developed a bit of a bench as well. Which is which is uh, we can count on, right? And some of those guys don't even get a play now, and we still we still can count on them when we need to. Um, and and the other thing I would say is I trust you know uh, Masai, Bobby, in the front office to if they see a move that they they think would help us, then and, and they make it, and, and we certainly are behind them in that, and we do the best we can to put the best team on the floor and put them in the best positions to succeed. Given how last year went and how you guys did get better and were able to raise your level when it mattered, have you figured out how good, how much room there is left for this team to improve in its current form once everyone's healthy and you got everyone together? Yeah, I mean, I think there's certainly um, lots of room for improvement. I, I would still say that the ceiling, uh, individually especially, is 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 continuing. You know, it's up there yet. We got we got some ways to go there, and then collectively, you know, you're always looking for more consistent play. I mean, even 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 though we've won 11 in a row, there was a, quite a few games in there. I'm not sure we played all that great, but we found a way to win, which is a good characteristic that we have. Um, we've played a little better in the last few, et cetera, but just always, always, you know, continuing to push for more, right? A little, little better defense, a little better shot contest, a little better rebounding, expanding some of those coverages, improving our communication. Um, effort, you know, all those things that, that we just got to keep polishing and pushing forward with. I think there's tons of room for improvement. Do you like the fact they moved the, the deadline before All-Star or whatever it was last year, the year before, and going into that break now knowing what your team will look like coming out of it? Um, I don't know if I like it yet or not. Gosh, I, I, 
I don't think it really matters all that much, but I think uh, I think the sooner is better, just to, just in general, to give your, give yourself more time to figure it out if you if you do have have moves. Yeah. Hey, Nick, the way they use the bonus going back to Indiana. Um, yep. You know how good he is on the perimeter. How yep. good he is in screen roll. Uh, how good he is in your comments and how you guard him. Yeah, he's he's really um, man. He's really improved um, and and is really a really a force out there. You know he does things physically, right, like all the time. You set screens, it's physical. You're going to feel it when he comes up to screen you. Um, his footwork's amazing, right? He gets out of the screen, he catches, he's back into some more footwork. It's it's really, really high-level stuff on this footwork. And then he really uses his body. You know, he's not all that big for as much as he scores inside, um, but he really puts his shoulder on you and his forearm on you and sometimes he uses the ball to push off with and he, he knows how to like create space down there um it's it's a tough challenge right it's a tough challenge i would imagine we have to use more than one guy uh throughout the game like who ronde, ronde might be back tomorrow yeah mark is not going to be back norm will not be back but i think ronde is on the questionable side of things and has a chance. He did go through practice today, but obviously we don't do a whole lot physical in practice, so hard to gauge. It's been a week since Mark went out of the Do you have a sense of where he's at? No, I, I don't really. I just think that he's um, he's in pretty decent shape, Eric, right? I, I would uh, imagine with the break coming, et cetera, I'm not sure we'll, we'll be rushing him to get him back before the break because then we get to buy another week or so. so. Uh, I wouldn't hold me to that. I'd certainly take him if he gets back before that, but I could see that as a scenario playing out.